hey guys welcome back so guys now we are continuing a laravel 9 e-commerce series and we are on the cart list page okay so guys in this video we'll be removing each item from the cart so guys let's get started so first let's move to this page guys of my my cart okay so we are continuing from the previous video and we are already on the cart page okay and this is the remove button here is the remove button with this red color okay so first step guys let's change this button i mean a tag to button tag so b u t t o n button all set and href to type and type equal to button all set and on this click we want an action or a call so wire colon click where you will tell remove cart item as simple and in this function you are passing the cart id so you can just copy the variable from here cart item of id as simple guys done and i just wanted to disable all the buttons when i click on any of the button so let's copy from here and paste it so whenever i click this button it should get disabled on loading it perfect and now guys i just wanted to show like when it is when i have clicked it should show removing and this should be hidden so we can achieve that using wire loading okay wire colon loading dot remove and then wire target okay so let's copy this button click okay so copy that and paste it here and instead of click you are going to tell target that's it so no changes and you are going to copy once again this paste below and just remove this loading dot remove on loading you have to show this so instead of remove you tell it's removing or deleting your cart whatever okay perfect so now guys we have created a remove cart item function so let's go to the live component of controller okay so this is a cart show where we are going to our cart show page only okay at the remove button so not to worry and now guys let's create a simple function here with the name remove cart item so the function name is going to be remove cart item and type is int because we are getting only the cart id okay all set and now guys you can write the simple code to delete your cart item call your cart model colon colon use a where condition so first we'll be checking the user id or the cart id okay anyhow in the second again and then delete the record that's it so first you'll be checking like auth underscore user which is authenticated user id as simple guys and now in the second where condition we'll be checking the primary key id of cart table and this is your cart id you are getting so let's set that and when it is success then you will directly delete the record if you want to check also you can write in a false condition like this cart id doesn't exist so you can do the validation also so guys let's do the validation so as simple let's make it to first and let's store this data in a variable like cart remove data okay equals and here you can check in a if condition is a if condition as simple here if it is true if the record exists then you are coming in and deleting the record so cart remove data of delete function as simple after deleting you can show the message and you have to hit the counter also here you have to emit this counter you can see that cart of four it is so when you delete that it should automatically loads right so you have to emit the event also so let me just get that event name 
where I have in the view product here is my event and let me copy the message also let's close and paste as simple guys so you don't have to worry what is this it's just a listener event listener in live wire okay so whenever you are deleting you just emit this it will automatically call that live wire and here you set the message like cart item removed successfully okay and success 200 perfect and now guys in else condition if your cart id or user id doesn't match at that time you can just show the message as something went wrong or cart item not found so let's keep a simple message like something went wrong something went wrong and here you show as error and it's 500 okay perfect done guys so this is the code for remove cart item and now let's get back so before testing let's refresh once cool and now guys i am going to remove this mi note 7 let's click here it's removing and you see that perfect cart item removed successfully and it's done and here you can see that cart count of three it is okay it was four and now it automatically updated to three cool so guys we have successfully completed how to remove the cart item from our cart list table and now guys let's continue next video about the total things and many more so thank you for watching this video guys please subscribe like and share